having a country order <laughs> and the all the composer is Sandra Jacobs um, now I must make a few remarks but I, I will let you just listen to a bit of the song unfortunately this is not a good recording that I received um, uh, and um, well okay let's just listen to a few seconds of the song and then I'll I'll make some remarks let's go wait a day but this is assuming the verse. And now we hit the course, but here comes the problem. Okay, and here the problem continues. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop it there. Um, I'm, I must make a few remarks. Um, one being, if you work without accompaniment, it's very, very dangerous. Um, if you cannot stick to a beat, then um, this won't work. Fortunately, Sandra can sort of hold her beat. Um, but if you don't have accompaniment, you don't have nothing to work by. And I think, Sandra, uh, the, the problem here is that the chorus and the verse, uh, the music is sort of similar so you have to find a way of distinguishing between the two and what I will do is um, I'm going to try and make this something which is musically pleasant to listen to as well as something that's very presentable so I will um, start off with the piano track just as sort of a guide track and I will in order to get variety between the verse and the chorus I will put the ver verse in, in a separate chorus from the uh, in a separate key from the chorus my apologies okay so let's um start off i'll just have an intro oh sh sorry what's this um, yeah, hang on a second okay here we go one two three four Verse again. 
outro. Okay, so it might not make sense really now, but as we progress, um, I'm sure it will eventually start to make sense. By the way, I'm using the Yamaha Tyros 4 for my sequencing tonight. I decided um, to only sequence on the keyboard tonight. Okay, so what we'll do now, yeah. we'll add a nice bass. Okay, so the bass isn't going to start initially. Nice sort of country and western feel. I inserted. It, it wasn't there in the original recording Sandra sent me, but um, the piano a few mistakes slipped in and here's the bad part for me to fix this on the keyboard as I'm where I'm sequencing now I'll have to play the entire piano part from where the first mistake occurred because once you drop in on a, on a track that you were have you that you've been recording um, it's very very hard to drop out especially if you cannot read what's on the screen so you have to um, drop in and play pretty much 
until the end of your track. Okay, so I'm going to play drums now. And as I said last week, finger drumming is really, really vital. You have to know what to do. So, okay, let's uh, put in some drums. drum tracks and then I will add some rhythm guitar by the way if you just joined us welcome tonight we are busy with a song composed by Sandra Jacobs which is called Cowboys and Boots and just to give you an idea from where we came with this recording Please. let's go away today there's no accompaniment, so it's quite a challenge to work with this. Um, usually I throw a big tantrum when someone sends me a track like this, but I thought, um, well, but let's give it a try and see what we can come up with. So here's my rhythm guitar. I will play it in a very peculiar way. I hope it works.
the rhythm guitar is now inserted. Now I'll just quantize this. Now you might have noticed the difference in how I play the guitar during the verse as to how I play it in the chorus. Um, okay, so yeah, just to illustrate again, in the verse I play mm, 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 on the off beats, and in the choruses I'll go just to make it a bit more busy. So what we'll do now is we'll add a muted electric guitar. Next one here. This is it. There we go. There we go. Uh, I don't want it at the beginning, so I'll add it later. Uh, come on. guitar isn't going to be loud we want it sort of deep in the mix it's just there to sort of emphasize the bass notes okay, so what we'll do now we'll add I think what about a banjo and add, let's add some banjo since this is sort of a country and western thing. okay where's my banjo oh, it's not a banjo Where's my banjo? Oh, there we are. Okay. Very 
synthetic parts. And what we'll do is we'll pan it hard left. banjo I am not I wanted to sort of lie deep-ish within the mix I don't want any instrument to really be obnoxious um, okay, I'm just quantizing the banjo as well I think we'll add some pedal steel now Let me just see where it is my pedal steel not quite Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's check. There we go. I think I should just save before our power utility um, decides to pull a trick on me. Okay, so here we go. No, 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 no. Oh, well, I just wiped my muted guitar, but fortunately I saved. Unfortunately, if you can't see, you have to turn off the keyboard and you have to turn it back on to get to where you was before you made this blunder. 
Um, I just need to mount the track again. Crap. There we are. Right. Thank heavens. I just open this track again. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's open. Now I must find the pedal steel. There we are. So let's play pedal steel. some strings in the choruses just to sort of bind it. By the way, if you just join us, um, I'm looking for a, 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 a sort of a name to call these Wednesday tracks by so that we can 
sort of market them under fellow musicians so that they can maybe um, make use of the offer. Um, I don't know how long it will last, but for now I will each Wednesday make a track for someone free of charge. So if you've got a nice sharp name, please leave it in the comments below. I want sort of to use this as sort of a marketing marketing tool. Okay, so we'll add some strings in the choruses. Here's the strings. But it will be, have to be very subtle, so here we go. Potentially we could add a hundred more instruments, but I think we have to leave room for the vocals as well as for the backing vocals. I think this is it for this track as far as I'm concerned. Maybe you might differ from me, but well, that's so. Um, I'll just have to save this now before I get rid of it, and then I'll be very upset. Um, come on. Okay. Yeah. So yes, thank you so much for watching. I really prefer working on the computer with Samplitude. Um, sequencing on the keyboard is, is very limited for me. But um, I just wanted to make sure that I explain sort of both ways in which I build a backing track or make a backing track. Um, thank you so much for joining. Is that someone that is here? Okay. Thank you so much for joining us. Um, next week, uh, Wednesday, 7 o'clock, we'll be back. And I'll be building another track on this coming Sunday. You can join me at 3.30 South African time for my usual Sunday concert. Have a wonderful and a warm Wednesday. Thank you so much.